All right, it's Phoenix Genesis for phoenixgenesis.com and our two YouTube channels, Phoenix Genesis and Frag Camp. We're with Harley Jr. This is Harley the Cat. We're hiking in Brand Park in Glendale, California. And we're letting Harley make the decision. She wanted to go back down the hill for a while, but now she wants to be with her dog and her daddy. So you can see she's walking back up the hill. And unlike a dog, you really got to let them go at their own pace. And there she is. There, see, she's going. She wants to be with her dog. Good girl. And uh, see our previous videos, we show the over-the-shoulder method. She's been kind of riding on my shoulders. Then Steve has the bag. We have the cat in the bag method we've shown. We also, Steve did a great video on how to put a harness and leash on your cat. Oops, sorry. And um, then we have also, you know, the over-the-shoulder and then, of course, the walking, actual walking on the leash method. And, uh, you know, the dog helps. She feels very comfortable. It's her dog. She always kisses him when he comes home, cleans his feet. And she wants to just kind of walk with the dog. He's a great guide for her. Watch out, Steve. We're going to get tangled. Oh, now she wants to take the lead. No, she's waiting for her dog. Anyway, if you've always wanted to walk with your cat, uh, you don't have a dog, which I'll see, then um, go over on that side, please. And this is just a, you know, hope we're an inspiration. Just go out and do it. I've been playing Call of Duty and uploading to YouTube and I really needed a break to uh, get off the computer. It's a beautiful November day, perfect day to hike. It's not a big hike, you know, so it's kind of perfect if you're kind of out of shape or disabled or injured or just want a short hike. You don't have time. It gets dark earlier in the winter. This is a nice, easy kind of hike. It's a lot of uh, this gravel, as you can see. Um, gravel paved fire lanes and there's a little bit of a trail but they've got railings on the way down probably it's like maybe a half hour loop it's not a hard one not of our three cats she's the one who really likes suki Siamese, our siamese likes to walk a lot too and uh, Merlin's a big wussy. He's the big tom orange tomboy, but he just likes to be a homebody or run around just the you know our yard. But yeah, Harley's kind of the adventurous one. She's the one who always wants to get the birds, and even though she never gets any, she likes to just you know she's all into the nature and. Yep. But yeah, you know, let your cat explore the fact that she's just comfortable with the leash and harness setup. That's the main thing. You can put the harness on home and just kind of let her get used to the harness. You want to make sure you have one that fits. It's not too tight on her, but not too loose that she can kind of escape. And also be very uh, cognizant of your surroundings. You know, make sure uh, there's coyotes out here and other wildlife. There's also uh, people that have dogs off the leash, some of which that are more prey dr driven than others. So you really want to... You know, it's good to go with like two people or just if yourself, don't put it, you know, be staring at your phone or putting headphones on, listening to music. Really be aware of your surroundings so that you can have an enjoyable experience for you and your cat. You don't want to be walking. And, you know, the worst thing that happen is your, you know, cat gets, you know, attacked by something or, you know, gets injured or even just gets terrified that then she's going to have a, he or she's going to have a phobia and not want to go out anymore. I need to make a mini Go GoPro harness for a cat. I think that'd be awesome. I'd love to kind of get her experience. We've done that with Ray. So we've done some GoPro videos. I have more to put up. But uh, it's kind of fun to see, like, the one we did of Ray going in the dog park through the dog's point of view. But anyway, see, they're going at a nice, even rhythm. I think it's great.